The following video is sponsored by InstantMaddenCoins.com. The only place to get Madden Coins instantly on every console and platform is InstantMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is up guys? Clickwood here back with another Madden Mobile video. And guys, today we are back with the Kings of the Gridiron packs. And I'm here to tell you guys, I would highly recommend against opening these. Because you have to look at it in a couple different ways. So first of all, they can only be opened with Madden dollars or Madden points. And that is very frustrating, of course, if you want to open up things with coins. Uh, you open up a, a limited edition to Marcus Ware, like I did, for example. I want to be able to use these coins and open up packs. So, it's very frustrating to me. And just on the principle of things, I wouldn't open up these packs because of that. But in addition to that, I just want to show you guys, these things are really not that good. It contains one elite program, set, hero, or master player, 93 or above. Now, the 93 or above is the big thing because the 93 or above players are really not that great necessarily. Like, even if you look at, like, this Brian Urlacher, for example, not necessarily the best card in the game. Like, it's decent, don't get me wrong, but it's not, like, anything spectacular. The Jerry Rice would obviously be crazy good. It's a 99 overall, but, um, I mean, there are other ones in here that you can get. Obviously, these three are, are very good cards, but um, uh, I guess the Urlacher, like I said, is okay, but... There are a whole bunch of them that are 93 or above that really aren't that great and you could just go buy them on the auction house for a lot cheaper than you would have to spend to actually get them out of these packs. So that's just my opinion. I would highly recommend against these and uh, we're definitely not going to be opening them in today's video. But what we do have is some fan favorite packs. Now, of course, these packs as well are not necessarily going to be the best value, but they're at least packs that you can open up with coins and at least you can get some decent stuff without having to spend a ton of money on the game. So I'm always a fan of that. So we'll go ahead and uh, we'll open up 10 of these fan favorite packs. So what I'm going to do is go in here to the store and uh, obviously you can get close to getting yourself a, uh, an Earl Thomas if you want to. Now these fan favorite packs are 50,000 coins each. So we're hoping to get some decent stuff out of here. But you never really know of course what you're going to pull. Most of the time you're just going to pull these collectibles. The weight training collectibles. Which you can then put into sets to get yourself gold players and stuff like that. Um, so sometimes you'll pull the actual player. Sometimes you won't. But what are you going to do? Um, and let's see here. We started off kind of weak. We're pulling a lot of these, um, these weight training collectibles. But... Um, you know, like I said, we can always pull something decent out of these packs as well. So we're going to open up, like I said, about 10 of them. Maybe we'll get something decent. Maybe not. So we've done three so far. Continue through. Come on, man. Give me something nice. Give me something nice. Damn. We're really missing, even on, like, the, the other things that are in the packs. Like, we haven't really pulled anything even decent of value, unfortunately. Reveal all. Damn. Well, at least we're getting, like, ourselves, like, a couple of gold fan favorites, but not really anything great so far. I think this is number five here. And anything decent? Hey, we did get an elite player. We got a Danny Shelton here. Now, this Danny Shelton can go into a couple different sets, so I might have to do that. I believe it goes into the Jamie Collins sets, so uh, we'll have to look at that. That might be something that we need to complete at some point players that seem to be pretty rare we get a random donovan McNabb collectible there in 84 overall okay take that but um yeah we'll have to look into those sets because i really think i should be pretty close to getting them done i think there was one player that i was missing so uh in order to do that we'll have to check it out now i got an upgrade here and it's a cameron Brait season stars so not a bad pull here 86 speed nah, 87 uh, excel not bad Decent catching with a 91. The run blocking is okay with an 81. So, decent tight end overall. It's better than what I currently have. Um, as far as, like, I think that would be my flex player, if, I know, if I'm thinking correctly. But, um, we'll have to look into that and see if that's something that we end up wanting to do. And, uh, you know, at least we pulled a couple of elite players out of this. We're going to open up two more packs, guys. Hopefully, we can get something decent out of these final two. And we're getting a lot of weight collectibles, like I said. So, that's always a good thing. But final pack guys and if you guys did enjoy this video make sure that you drop a like on it and subscribe to the channel if you're new and unfortunately we miss so again guys that is going to do it thanks so much hope you enjoyed it and i will talk to you guys again soon